back to another LSPDFR 0.4 patrol. Yesterday when we did the Blaine County Sheriff's Office patrol, I completely forgot that I was supposed to create a separate character that would be our deputy character. I want different characters for different departments. That way it makes a little more sense. So let's go ahead and do that to create a new character once you've already created one. I think you just need to hit escape, go to the LSPDFR sub menu, character, switch character. All right, and we're gonna create a new LSPDFR character. I want this guy to look pretty different than my main characters. That way we can distinguish the two different officers. The name for this new character is gonna be Sam Brown. He's gonna be our deputy in Bling County Sheriff's Office. All right, we'll go ahead, choose him to use and get him started. So right now there's just one house that LSP of our uses. Hopefully we'll get some houses up in different areas of the map. And of course they all start off with this kind of default clothing. So we're gonna head up to Sandy Shore and get on duty. Here's our uniform. Today we're gonna be in the Crown Vic. We haven't used this car. This is part of Kilroy's pack. Once again, guys, just be patient with me. I should have the 0.4 mod document up sometime this week, and it'll go up on the Discord as well. So if you're not a member of the Discord, go ahead and join us at discord.gg slash FTM. Dispatch, go ahead, show me 1041-108. We have... Dispatch League in 18, copy that. We got reports of a domestic disturbance here in Sandy Shores. We're gonna head to the scene, check it out. Dispatch, go ahead and show us en route. All right, looks like it's gonna be down this way. Okay. Dispatch link in 18. Go ahead, show me on scene. Can I requ request an additional unit for backup code two? Assistance I just feel safer on, if we uh, got an additional Armadillo car here. Avenue. In our role play server, oh, if it's oh, nighttime, oh, it's actually a requirement that we have an additional officer for a traffic stop. So here's the other officer rolling up. Perfect. Hey man. Hey yeah, I got a call about domestic disturbance, so let's go check it out. I'll kick your fucking teeth in. Hey guys, calm down. You're about to bleed, shit. You cheating? I knew it. Why don't you two take a walk and cool down, okay? Whatever. All right. You okay, ma'am? Stay there! Stay there! Ma'am, are you okay? Okay. So, was he threatening you at all today? Alright, well, we got a 911 call for uh, about a fight going on, so that's why we're here. Just want to make sure everything's okay, but if uh, he's going to leave... Does he have somewhere he can stay tonight? He does? Okay. Well, if he stays there and, uh, you know, until you guys get this figured out, I think that would be best. I would hate to uh, have to come back again tonight. Okay, is there anything else uh, we can help you with? All right. All right. Well, stay safe, ma'am. Go on, you idiot. Get out of here. Damn. All right. Uh, appreciate the backup. Looks like we're able to resolve that pretty quickly. Um, I just didn't know. Yep. Yeah, we should be uh, all good here. Thank you. All right, so that was really not an issue, thankfully. Um, I much prefer it be that way. We got the male party, part of the party to leave. So he uh, took a walk to Kawath. Obviously they're upset about something. He's claiming she's cheating. We don't really know the backstory. I don't really care too much. We just wanted to get the two parties separated. 
and prevent uh, any violence from happening. All right, dispatch, we're gonna be code four and back 10-8. Got a vehicle smoking here. Looks like there's a blue attire. Let's see if they're all right. We'll get a play check before I pull them over. They're driving on that. I believe it was a driver's side tire that was completely blown. This car's smoking too. Dispatch Lincoln 18. Can we get a 1028 on 47 David Zebra Robert 627? No registration, no insurance. Owner license expired. Okay. Proceed with caution. We're going to go ahead and pull them over. Once again, we're gonna get an additional unit up here. Get the spotlight on them. Dispatch Lincoln 18, we're gonna be on a traffic stop, Alhambra Drive. Can I get an additional unit? Backup needed in Sandy Shores. Once again, we are just being safe here. We don't want to be outnumbered. It, it only appears one person in the car, but um, you never know what's going to happen. I'd rather have somebody else here. So we'll uh, wait on them to arrive and they're coming right now. All right. And stop them for vehicle damage. He's got a lot of uh, damage, smoke coming out of his car. Good day. Hey, if you haven't seen the flash of light yet, look at this. That is pretty cool animation. We got an odor of alcohol coming from uh, the car as well. That just looks so cool. How you doing today, sir? I'm Deputy Sam with the Blaine County Sheriff's Office. You know, I pulled you over today. Hello. Well, I pulled you over for uh your vehicle i noticed a lot of smoke coming out of it i was concerned uh if it was safe to drive you're driving without a tire here on the front part of your car were you aware of that sir okay uh can i see some identification please could you please show me your id okay bubba all right bubba Hang tight for me, I'll be right back. My partner's gonna stand over there, okay? So our police partner noticed an odor of alcohol pretty much immediately. So we are probably going to step him out of the car for a sobriety test. Let's pull up his information here and see if it comes back with anything. Bubba Williams expired. Oh my gosh. I mean, even if he's not drunk, he's got, uh, I, don't, I believe, no insurance on the car, expired license. He shouldn't even be driving. I don't even know what the 13-hour rule is. Who knows what the 13-hour rule is? Please tell me. I've never heard of that. Uh, let's pull up his car. No insurance. He is a registered owner. It's not registered. No insurance and expired license. Right now, my primary concern is if he's intoxicated or not. So we're going to ask, ask him to step out of the vehicle and probably do a breathalyzer test. Sir, can you step out of the vehicle for me? Hold up. Thank you very much. Uh, if you just follow me over here, let's go off the side of the road so we don't get hit. Okay. All right, here's the deal. Oh, where's your shirt, sir? Okay. You don't have one. Wh whatever, that's fine. Um, so my partner here, he noticed an odor of alcohol coming from the vehicle. I did it as well. Have you been drinking today? Alcoholic drinks are my favorite. Okay, so I'm gonna take that as an affirmative, a yes. Do you mind if we do a quick breathalyzer test to determine if you've been drinking tonight? Okay, you don't have a problem. 
All right, I'm just going to have you blow into this like you're blowing up a balloon. All right, continue to blow until I tell you to stop. Blow, blow, blow. Come on. Thank you. There we go. I think we got it. Oh yeah, so you're um, you're almost three times the limit. So if you turn around there, you're you place under arrest for DUI. Love that noise. All right, sir, uh, is there anything illegal on you or in your vehicle? I don't wanna go to jail. Well, at this point it's too late. Uh, partner, if you could go ahead and pat him down for me. We'll check the car here in a second. All right, he's got some knuckle dusters. Just watch him on search his car. It says there's nothing in here. So the context menu is supposed to let us search the car. It can be a little finicky, but there we go. Search the vehicle. I still need to remove search warrant because I think we're just going to use stop the pad. We got open beer cans. He's got alcohol all in this vehicle. Yep. That's what we thought. All right, sir. I'm gonna place you uh, inside my car right here. Watch your head. He's highly intoxicated. All right, sir, your car is gonna be towed. You'll be able to get it when you get out of jail. It's going to the impound lot. Uh, also, sir, you've got no registration on the car, no insurance, and your license is expired as well. So you're gonna have to take care of all those things before you even get your car back out. My goodness. All right. Let's go ahead and request that tow service. Uh, since it's got the flat, we're gonna get a flatbed out here. Backup required in Sandy Shores. All right, here's our flatbed coming through. All right, appreciate it. That's picked up. All right, man. If you want to head out of here, I just got to do some uh, paperwork for him. Appreciate the help. Probably just take him into jail ourselves. Okay. All right, so let's go ahead and write him up. So we're going to cite him for the vehicle stuff. So that's going to include documentation. It's going to have the expired driver's license. He's going to have no insurance and no registration as well. So those are all citations. I think we got it to that go through. Yep. Okay. And then now we're going to do a rest report charges of DUI. You also had the open container. Oh man. I can't even see this whole thing. What's this one? That's not, it's a felon. It's definitely a felony. Um, if they fail to provide a breath sample, we can actually charge them with that too. Uh, he had the open containers of alcohol. I believe in most cases that is just going to be a ticket, but I'm not going to be too concerned about that. So Bubba there got into some trouble. We'll go ahead and take him in to the station for drop off dispatch. We get 18, bring him one in for drop off. I wasn't even near you. All right, he's gonna be dropped off. All right, appreciate the help. So I have a question for you guys. 
if you use natural vision remastered are you getting frame rate issues i don't get it prior to running lspdfr so in my opinion it makes me think it's more lspdfr related but a lot of people are not getting issues i was just curious if people also running natural vision remastered with 0 0.4 were having problems actually did turn down a couple settings to try to help it performance if i go into my graphics um i'll show you what i'm currently at so i'm leaving that on times four anything less to me looks pretty rough uh 60 fps v-sync on i pretty much scaled down distance scaling variety and density to see if that would help with loading and it does a little bit i also turned off the reflection msaa i used to have that on times two everything else i've pretty much kept the same let me know what you guys think um, that is going to conclude today's episode as always if you had feedback leave me a comment down below uh, that 0.4 mod document i'm gonna have it up this coming week so look forward to that thanks for watching and i'll catch you guys on the next patrol